I'm getting like Willy Wonka vibes for some Right, reason. like the silver lo- the wrapper and stuff. Yeah. So you know, Brian used the word opposite of mild right before we started filming. Not this one. I understand the, the that. We're talking one. future things and he used the word opposite of mild. Right. Hoping I wouldn't feel as bad. So these both came from Pucker Butt. They're made actually by Willie Peach Chocolates, who I, um, they make some of the best chocolate that I've ever had. So it's like a collaboration between Willie Peach and Pucker Butt. And they're sent to me by Dark and Bella from Heat 101. Okay. okay. So they sent me two bars. This is um, Linda's Level Up Bar. It's a mild bar. Okay, we're gonna get an idea of what we're, the style of the bar maybe, but then we've got the Ed Curry's Experience, which is the next bar that you will hopefully be signed up for. That's, so, is, that's where he used the word, opposite of mild. It's the opposite of mild. Um, Dark and Bella at He 101 says is like the hottest thing they've ever had, so there's that. Um, and okay. it sucks coming from such nice people. I know, Because they've right? been here and we've met them. They've met can, them. But, like... And they're monsters, they can handle <laughs> it. So I think it's, it was a, this is a half pound a uh, bar of dark, a uh, half pound dark chocolate bar, and you're gonna eat this entire half pound right now. No, you're not. I hate you so much. <laughs> uh, okay, so this is Linda's level up bar. So Linda is uh, Ed Curry's wife. So this is mm-hmm. the white. It's like a husband wife combination bar. Cool. So the, she's got the mild half. He's got the extreme half. Uh, a delicious dark chocolate with apple cinnamon caramel filling infused with cayenne peppers. So we're just talking cayenne pepper heat here. So I think we and need... apple cinnamon. That yeah. awesome. doesn't it sound awesome. That sounds pretty awesome. It sounds amazing. Dark chocolate. And dark apple chocolate cinnamon. bar with an apple cinnamon core. And caramel? Yeah, yes. dude. It sounds so, so. I just signed up for like the best video ever. I know, man. <laughs> but it's it, the next one is where we're, where we're gonna oh, really. I'm going on now. vacation again. I know, right? So, all right, I'm just gonna pop this whole thing and see what it looks like. I'm getting like Willy Wonka vibes or something. Right, reason. like the silver lo- the wrapper and stuff. Yeah. Okay, so it looks like a Willy cheats. Willy cheats. A Willy, Willy Pete's. Half pound bar. It's got. They always have these lines on them, and they're a situation. I've done a bunch of his bars before, and they come ripping hot to, I guess, the more mild, mild. side. Okay, so let's see here. Uh, it says, warning, these chocolates are not for sensitive to spicy foods. It should be kept out of reach of small children, pets. Do not use as a prank. Eat at your, your own risk. I don't know how much that's really going to come into play here. I feel like that's a like a bucket thing he puts on all the A packages. general warning. Uh, it's manufactured for Willie Peach Chocolate, distributed by Pucker Butt. All right. Ingredients are sugar. There's a lot of ingredients. Hydrogenized perm corn oil, cottonseed oils, non-fat dairy, dry, uh, dry milk, cocoa, cocoa glycerol, lactoesters, fatty acids, soy lectithin, salt, caramel filling, which is corn syrup, sweetened condensed milk, coconut oil, sugar, water, uh, glycerol, monosonorate, artificial vanilla flavor, freeze-dried apples, ascorbic acid, Citric acid and less than 0.0025% of calcium chloride, cayenne pepper, and cinnamon. So, the only reason Brian read that so fast is because people comment how good I am at Dude, they do. <laughs> you are so good. <laughs> yeah, well, okay, well, what, what number ingredient was cayenne peppers? 17th. I'm going to count. It's 24th. Year. Okay. <laughs> but good guess. <laughs> um, I'm going to snap off two bars and we'll each have okay. one. Is that okay? Yeah, it works for me. Am I okay with me snapping off your piece? I am completely fine with it. Okay, well, you better be because I'm already doing it. I, I trust you. Okay, this is snapping in a weird way. Oh, this look is at that filling, dude. The this caramel is, thickness, dude. This is look at that. Look at how hard. it's almost it's it's almost put together like a pop tart. Yeah. Yes. Like it's like a pop tart situation. Look at that thing. Oh my god. Let me take that piece. This smells perfect. I think I actually smell a little bit of the cayenne. Maybe not. I kind of think I, I think I kind of. Do I don't know. Thing. It's like a hint of like a pepperish. Something but I'm over. definitely smelling dark chocolate. Well, yeah. All right. I'm probably gonna have to speed up this up because this is gonna be some gnarly chewing noises. Yes. I, these like you're like this is so like big and thick. I remember my jaw hurting from chewing the last time <laughs> I did one of these. <laughs> All right. Cheers. So spicy. It's a little hot. I got a little kick. <laughs> Maybe that warning wasn't there for no reason. <laughs> I mean, I know we're just dealing with cayenne pepper here, but this is way hotter than I thought it was going to be. Especially being 24th. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And it's it's like the cayenne pepper just rubs against the top of your throat just enough to mm-hmm. feel the burn and then it goes away. Mm-hmm. Like, it's a really good burn. Mm-hmm. Like, the chocolate probably helps. The caramel probably helps. I'm trying to get it down. I did better than you? That's weird. <clears throat> okay. 
This is a way different experience than I thought I was gonna have. It, there's, I actually have several things to say that are not consistent of what I expected. Okay, so, uh, first of all, you're gonna do, let's do a heat scale real fast, okay? okay. Three, two, one, one. two. I'm a two. I'm a one. See, it's, uh, okay, I, I'm, I'm not, I'm absolutely fine, but I think that this is hotter than the flavor of heat. It's like, okay. I am feeling heat. When I said I was a one, it's because the way the heat hits you. When I first swallow, I was probably a two. Because like I said, it's like the cayenne pepper rubs against your throat, you get that heat, and then it goes away. Yeah. And it probably ramps up to a two, but then it goes away pretty quickly for me. Yeah, I agree. Um, I'm getting a lot of like caramel situation. Yeah. I get the cinnamon for sure. I'm not getting as much apple as I was thinking. I, 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 I detected no apple, actually. I get, uh, maybe, maybe the slightest amount. Honestly, when I was eating it, I forgot that it was in there, so I probably wasn't looking for it. Mm -hmm. So that was probably my fault, too. I... I'm actually going to say that this is hotter than I thought it was it's, going to be. It's much hotter than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, like With I, how low on the list it was and just being cayenne. Yeah. Like, I was expecting, like, basically an undetectable yep. amount of heat. Yep. And there's absolutely there a detectable. There is detectable heat in this. This is perfect. It's like a very casual, slight, yep. like, spicy snack. Like, if this was just a candy bar, this would be one of the best candy bars. Yeah, absolutely. Like, out there. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and even with a hot candy bar, this is probably one of the best hot candy bars I've ever had. Yeah, absolutely fantastic. Um, I mean, you could give this to, I mean, children, everyone. Yeah. Like, anybody who, like, likes to casually like spicy food. Yep. Um, I think they're going to be impressed by this. If somebody who doesn't like spicy food that much, they're going to be like, this, this could is... be a pretty good intro, Yeah, too. they're going to be like, this because is really it's, hot. it's a noticeable heat, but it's not, like... Holy crap! My day's ruined. Yeah, but then it, it but it dissipates so it dissipates quickly. quickly. Like the cayenne, chocolate, the chocolate and caramel probably help. With yeah, that. the cayenne is just it doesn't stick around yeah. long. But you like it like wakes your senses up yep. like immediately. You're just like, wow, this actually like packs a bit of a punch. But then you realize you're going to be just fine. Yep. Um, okay. I mean, I've had a lot of stuff from Willie Pete, and he just n consistently knocks it out of the ballpark with the quality of the product. And this yep. is just another one that is just so freaking tasty. I feel like. I feel like we didn't get a lot of the apple. Like I feel like we might not have. I feel like that's an apple piece. Like that white. Break it off. Right another there. bite. Let's see if I can get into like where we see it. An actual. So it could also just be where it lays in the bake. Yeah, you know, like maybe they just need to add. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm gonna take. You're fine. There it is. So. The um, the white pieces are like the, are the freeze dried apple pieces that are in here, and I mean that's the only thing I want to say. It's like I want like so many more of them. I'll say, you just need to eat two pieces. Like just eat that piece of chocolate. Oh really? Well, it's hotter. Really? Yeah, I think the cayenne's in with the chocolate. Mhm. Mm I think I yeah. think it's I think it's chocolate infused cayenne. Yeah, you're right. And it's hotter if you just eat the chocolate. So I think the caramel is what was taking away from that heat a little bit because it's in the chocolate. I agree. See, it says delicious dark chocolate with apple cinnamon caramel fillings. And then it says infused with cayenne peppers. There it is. Okay. So that but, makes sense. But no, it's, it, it makes it seem like the caramel filling is infused with the cayenne, but I don't think it is. I, I don't think it is. It's I think it's in the chocolate. It's in I think chocolate. it's infused in chocolate. Or maybe it's in both, but there's more of it in the chocolate. I'm not sure. I don't know. It's true. But anyways. Fantastic. Very, very tasty. Product. Um, I mean, it's a half pound bar, so you can definitely share this with a lot of people. Yeah. Like, I feel like I just eat like 500 calories in chocolate. But anyways, okay, in the description below, there's going to be a link to a, a couple different things. Um, there's going to be a link to Willie Pete's, so you can just pick this up. There's going to be a link to Pucker Butt, so if they sell it at Pucker Butt, you can pick it up. Wonderful, wonderful people over at both companies. Um, I'm trying to do a collaboration with Willie Pete on a, on a bar, so we'll see if that ever happens. We've been talked for I mean, like two years now on that, so we will see. Um, also, a link to Justin. Uh, what were you doing right before this? <laughs> trying to ramp two pieces of lumber onto the bathroom. He was trying to ramp two pieces of lumber onto the bathroom. Those With the words, my RC car. Those are the words that he said. Yep. Go check that out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hope you enjoyed. See you guys on the next one. Hey, this is Brian Ames. Uh, please click the subscribe button that you see right there, and uh, you'll subscribe to my videos. Uh, from now on, I'm going to be eating a lot of peppers. It's going to, oh man, it's going to be great. Bye.